In this video, we'll be looking at how to integrate Shipworks with BrightPearl. If you don't already have Shipworks, you'll need to download it from shipworks.com. You can get a free trial for 30 days, during which you can integrate and test it out with your BrightPearl account. Before setting up the integration, you'll need to email us here at BrightPearl in order to activate the API access on your account. Simply send us an email to api at brightpearl.com requesting API access on your account, remembering to give us your BrightPearl account ID. Once we've done that, we'll let you know, and then you'll be able to go ahead with the integration to Shipworks. So let's look now at how to set up the integration. The first thing you need to do is create a new staff member in your BrightPearl account. This is how Shipworks will connect to BrightPearl. Go to Setup, Staff and Users, and add a new staff member. It doesn't matter what you name your staff member, but something with Shipworks in the name might be useful so you know what this record is for. You'll need to enter an email address. This will be entered into the setup within Shipworks, so keep a note of what you enter. You can use any email address, as long as it's not the same as your BrightPal company email or any of your other staff members. Once the staff member record is created, you'll need to set a password. Make sure you keep a note of the password along with the email address as they'll both be entered into the Shipworks setup in a moment. You'll also need to check that there is a green tick in this API column to say that Shipworks has allowed access to your BrightPal account. Also a good idea to restrict access to the back office for this login, so click the icon to change it to a cross. This will mean that no one can log into your BrightPal account in the usual way via the login screen using this email and password. This record is purely to create a connection between your BrightPal account and Shipworks. That's all you need to do in BrightPal, so let's switch over to Shipworks and complete the integration. If you're installing Shipworks for the first time, you can connect to BrightPal during the setup process. You'll reach the store wizard like this. If you are already using Shipworks, you can add a new store by going to Manage, Stores, and clicking the Add Store button. This will display the same store wizard window. First of all, you need to select the type of store. For integrating BrightPearl, select Generic Module. So this is where we enter the email address and password of the Shipworks staff member you created in BrightPearl a moment ago. Your module URL will depend on where you are located and your time zone. You can find out which URL you need from our support documentation. Simply copy and paste the URL into Shipworks. But make sure you amend the account code section to your own BrightPearl account ID. You can find your own account ID within the application. So I'll paste that URL into Shipworks, making sure I change the account code. Next, you'll be asked to enter some contact information about your store. Next, you have the opportunity to specify how far back Shipworks should go through your BrightPearl orders when it downloads for the first time. I'm going to download orders from the last 30 days. Next, specify whether you want Shipworks to automatically update online orders. If you want to receive emails from Shipworks, you can configure an email account. And if you want to activate the automatic download of orders from BrightPearl into Shipworks, you can specify how often that should be. I'm using a trial Shipworks account, so I click Next to continue, completing the setup process, so clicking Finish will take me straight into Shipworks. Whenever you want to download Goods Out Notes from BrightPearl into Shipworks, click the Download button. Open Goods Out Notes from BrightPearl become orders in Shipworks, where you can process and ship them. If you need to edit any of your store details, find your store under Manage and Stores. Here you can edit your store contact details, automatic download settings, and the connection with BrightPearl. 